Hey guys, I just wanted to share with you, um, over our spring break, we just took a little day trip to a little um, German town that I love that is not too far away from where I live. And um, my youngest son had never been there. Um, in fact, the last time my son Riley, my middle son, who's almost 17, was there was when I was pregnant with Asher. And Asher is 13. So I go there every year because I go with um, my, all the women in my family do a big shopping trip every year and we go there every year. So I am there every year anyway. And last year also my husband took me, that was part, like one of the days of my um, birthday extravaganza weekend that he surprised me with. One of the days was there. So it's a place that I love and I like to go to and do go to at least yearly. And um, yet my youngest son had never been there and my almost 17 year old hasn't been there since he was like three. So um, <laughs> it, it's been a long time. It's been a long time. Now my oldest son goes there quite a bit because his girlfriend loves it. So they go there several times a year actually because they always go near her birthday in December and actually they were just there a few weeks ago and stuff too. So um, we, I love this place and so we decided to take the boys for a little day trip during spring break. So it was the Thursday of our spring break. It absolutely was the perfect weather day. It was 65 and sunny. It felt fantastic in Michigan. 65 and sunny in March is like, you're doing real good. You're doing real good. So um, we thoroughly enjoyed that. It was just the perfect day for it. So it was on the 20, no, 28th. It was March 28th that we went. So um, there is a place there called... Bronner's. Bronner's Christmas Wonderland. It's the largest Christmas store in the, is it in the world? Let me show you the bag. World's largest Christmas store, okay, is Bronner's. And um, so I wanted to take the, we wanted to take the boys there because it's just cool. It is so, there's so much to see. It is a Christmas Wonderland. So we took the boys there first and um, we ended up getting a few things. Um, now, I saw this. It was in their clearance section for $5.98, and it was $9.99. Um, and when I saw it, my husband was like, yes, that's you. Um, and it says, my heart is full this season because I am all known for saying my heart is so full. Like, I just get very, just so happy. I don't even know how else to express it. And I just spit all over this in my true llama style. And um, I just, I christened it a little, you know, for Christmas. But anyway, um, my heart is so full during the Christmas season. I could burst. I am like the biggest dork. I am a small child at Christmas time. Like I just, I love it so incredibly much. So when I saw this and it has little jingle bells and it looks like a gift tag and it's just, and it's got a little mason jar. I mean, there's so much cuteness happening with this one little thing that I just had to have it. So I got it. So that was one thing that I got there. Um, also, we knew we wanted to be able to get something um, since our little dog, Sasha, passed away um, January 20th. Um, it was hard on our family, and she's been with us. She had been with us for a long time, like 11 years. And so um, we found this little ornament. Actually, my youngest son, Asher, did and was like, can we please get this to put a picture of Sasha and put it on our tree? And it just seemed perfect. It was $6.99, which you'll see. And it says, I received love and devotion with the wag of a tail, which I think is so cute. And then you can just put um, a little picture of your doggy in there. So she was a little black and white Shih Tzu. And we'll have her little picture in there to hang on our Christmas tree every year because she was very special to us and a little part of our family. So I thought that was really cute. And then my most favorite, 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 favorite thing from this whole trip that I got. Actually, I'm going to skip. We're going to skip over for a second because I want that to be last. Um, we then, so Bronner's is in Frankenmuth. And then just down the road is like the main town of Frankenmuth. And where you can park and you can just walk to all these different little shops and all that kind of stuff. So, um, and so in Frankenmuth, we were doing a bunch of little just shopping and stuff. We got a bunch of food type things like burnt peanuts from Rouse Country Store, which I love that store. Um, we got the Popcorn Wagon is this place in what's called the River Shops. And we got dill pickle popcorn is my favorite. So we got that. And we also got a cheddar 
bacon, bacon cheddar popcorn, also very good. Um, we went to go to my favorite crepe place because they have vegan crepes there. And the poor girl was working by herself and it was like a 35 minute wait. So I was like, eh, never mind. So guess what? We're going there for my birthday. Um, but anyway, <laughs> so we went to the castle shops. There's the Bavarian Inn and there's Zenders. They both do chicken dinners. Zenders is the famous one for chicken dinners. Um, I never, we never go there for that because for one thing I can't eat pretty much any of that food. But even like back in the day, it just was never that exciting to me. So, um, but... I love the shops at Zenders and Bavarian Inn, and they're both like downstairs kind of in their stores, at least. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I'm just like da, da 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 But anyway, at the Bavarian Inn Castle shops, I found this necklace. When I saw it, I was like, that's so cool. And you know how like in little shops and stuff, a lot of things are like stupidly expensive. So I expected it to be. So when I saw that it was only $7.99, I was like, I'm getting that. So it's this necklace, very simple, silver with just like these wood and like open. I don't know. I just thought it was really cute and just simple. I don't know. Like when you're wearing something colorful, but you still want an accessory, like something, or just even just if you're totally going simple and just, I just, I don't know. I just loved it. There was just something about it that caught my eye. And um, the really cool thing about it is it's made out of all recycled aluminum and scrap wood. So it's just recycled materials that make this necklace. So I think it's just a fun piece. It's something different and I was really excited about it. So I got it for myself. And then um, we went over to right near there, it's like 15 minutes away I think, um, is Birch Run, which has like outlets and that kind of stuff. So we went over there for the outlets and to go have lunch or dinner actually and things like that. And um, this is really boring, but I was excited to get them. There was a store called Vanity Fair there, which is similar to kind of like a TJ Maxx type thing, but they don't have like makeup and that kind of stuff. But, um, and I, they had this three pack of cotton multi-purpose kitchen towels for $2.99 and I just really liked them. Like I'm like, oh, those are fun and springy and whatever and we'll go good in my kitchen so I got those because I'm a dork and I get excited about things like that and we also got like my youngest son I think we got him four pairs of shorts because they had shorts for like four or four ninety nine there like really nice shorts and um at Old Navy my son Riley got a really cool like zip up that was on clearance and stay tuned because you're gonna see my try on haul at the end here of all the things I got at Old Navy clearance, it was really good. But my most favorite thing ever, my most favorite thing I got on this trip, when we were at Bronner's Christmas Wonderland, my son Asher, who's 13, as I've said, he saw this and he said, Mom, isn't your favorite word joy? And I'm like, yes. And he's like, and you love Christmas. And he's like, you need this. And I was like... Oh, it is super cute and you know, whatever. And he's like, no, but you need this. And he's like, I still have money left from Christmas. This kid is awesome with money, by the way. He doesn't just like get money and blow it. He like saves up and takes forever to decide what he wants to spend it on. Like taking him to a store to spend his money is like a nightmare because he takes forever. But I'm glad because he's not like an impulsive, just spend your money on whatever kind of thing. So, um, he had money saved still from Christmas and he's like, I have money saved I want to buy you that. You need that. I, I'm going to get that for you. He like insisted that I have it. And I thought it was the cutest thing ever. And so he got me this little joy Christmassy winter. It'll stay out all winter. Um, because how cute that the O is a little snowflake. And it's got glitteries. If you can't see it, I don't know. But I just thought that was so cute and that he wanted me to have this so much. And so I am actually going to write on the back the date and his age and all that because stuff like this is so precious to me. Like these are things that I will keep forever. And how sweet that your kids think about you like that. This mom, I'm telling you what, I'll cry about anything. Anything my kids do for me, I lose it. But like I love my boys so much and things like that that they just... Pay attention to things that are special to you, that they know you like, that know would make you happy. I think that's so special and so sweet, and I'm so thankful that I have such thoughtful, loving 
kids like that. Like, I love them so incredibly much. They have no idea. Our kids never know. They never know. <laughs> and um, I think they know when they become parents because knowing how much I love my kids, I realize how much my parents love me. But so this was my most treasured, wonderful, exciting um, thing that I got on that day of our spring break. So I thought that was so sweet and I love it and I will keep it forever and it will make me smile for the rest of my life. And um, so now I hope you enjoyed these little things that I picked up and um, I want you to go ahead and watch my try on of my items that I got on clearance at Old Navy. And thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you very soon. Bye. You're gonna have to please excuse me during this video as far as my hair because I'm gonna be taking shirts on and off a million times and it's gonna be a mess and I'm not gonna fix it in between every time. But anyway, this is the first um, item that I got from Old Navy, which is wrinkly and stuff because I didn't get it all ready for the video either. So, but I just wanted to give you an idea of some of the things I got. This shirt cost $5.97 on clearance and um, I just paired it with my skinny jeans as I fall over and my Toms and just like a very simple casual spring outfit. Um, I'll show you, kind of give you a, up close. It's got this really cute detailing with the gold and navy um, stripes there. And on the bottom, on the sides here, it has these little slits. And I just thought it was a really cute, lightweight, perfect for spring in Michigan and fall too. And I just really liked the colors. I don't have anything else like this. So it's just plain simple but you could make it cutesy with some extra jewelry if you wanted to or just keep it really simple and casual which is kind of how I like it so that's kind of how I styled it okay next up is this little cheers my dear sweatshirt it's a really thin lightweight I love like this blush pink color I thought was so cute this was on clearance for $4.97 and I just love like the little sparkle I think this is super cute like around Christmas um in New Year's time and stuff just I don't know like a little simple festive kind of cute shirt and I just loved how it's like so lightweight and comfy and I like that it's a little bit longer because I like when my sweatshirts are kind of down like that it's just I don't know it's comfy to me and then these pants are the pixie um, style that Old Navy carries that I have discovered I love they work perfectly for me like the ankle length ones they're supposed to be ankle length for you know people of average height like fit me like normal pants <laughs> so um I love those and I love these and these were on clearance for $5.97 and I like the angle that the pockets are on like just the way the design this has like kind of down the front these lines here sorry I didn't even bother to put shoes on um and then in the back it's just like this I like they come up a little bit higher so it's comfortable and like I don't feel like I'm you know what I mean like I don't like low-rise pants and Right now, your girls put on a couple extra LBs that I need to get rid of, so I'm not feeling very comfortable. And um, these definitely make me feel a little more comfortable than a pant that's a lower rise and gives a little muffin top uh, action. I don't want that. But anyway, so yeah, 597. Love the color. Wouldn't necessarily put these together. I mean, I can, but I, just for the sake of showing them to you and not making this video 100 years long, um, I put them together. But I do like these colors together a lot. So, um, that doesn't bother me, but yeah, these are super lightweight, great for spring, great for fall, great for summer even. Um, sometimes the nights get a little bit chilly, so even in the summer. So, um, yeah, I just really like these pants. I thought they were really cute and for six bucks, why in the world would I not get these? So that is my next two items. Okay, next up. The only thing that from this outfit that is from Old Navy are these pants, which are the exact same, that pixie style of the maroon ones or burgundy that I just showed you previously. Um, but I wore these out the other night when we went out to the movies and out to eat and stuff. And I just paired it with a black, simple black shirt um, and a jean jacket and then my little wedge booty things here. Um, and just kind of rolled the bottoms up, cuffed them up. And... Um, I love this outfit. I just think it's really fun and cute. The extra, just the little color of the pants, um, just gives you a little, little extra something. And um, I had jewelry and stuff on, but um, I just really like how these pants fit. They're so comfortable and they're just so cute. And for five ninety seven, like seriously, because these were also five ninety seven, so I could not pass them up. 
And um, if I can find more colors and patterns, my, if you haven't, I'm going to go ahead and insert a picture of me wearing the outfit. I took a picture when I was in the Target dressing room of this, pretty much this outfit. I did have a long sleeve black tee on actually that night, but um, same idea. But anyway, here's the picture of what my outfit looked like that night. Um, I was just feeling really good in it. Like I really liked it. And um, so I thought it was just a really easy thing to pair together and you can change out your jewelry to add different color and do whatever like that. I'll also go ahead and insert right now a picture of my camo um, pair of my pixie pants from Old Navy. Just to give you an idea, I didn't get them this trip. Actually, the picture that that's from, I was wearing them on the trip where I got these ones. Um, but just, I love the style of these pants. They fit me so well. So if you're really short, I'm not even five foot one, just slightly under. Um, if you're really short, you might want to check out this style of pants. So it's the pixie style from Old Navy and like the pixie ankle length is like perfect for me. So um, definitely check those out if you're a shorty like I am. But all right, on to the very last thing that I get from Old Navy that day. Okay, disclaimer, I would never wear my hair up like this with this dress because it makes me look like an old lady. But when I tried this dress on, my hair was down and it was really cute. I do really like the dress. Um, it's like a blue floral kind of long sleeve, but it's very lightweight. So it's great for spring and even summer because it's just very lightweight. And um, I just think it's so cute. It has this little detail up here. You can actually undo it if you want, which I'll kind of show you just so you can. It's just like a little hook and eye closure. So that might make it look a little less old lady if I don't have it done up like that. Um, but I like the length of it. Please excuse, I do not have my toenails painted and I do not let people see my feet without my toenails painted, just for the record, because I hate feet. I think they're disgusting. But I don't have them done yet, sorry, because um, it hasn't been warm enough here to wear shoes where your feet are showing. But anyway, so I just paired it with like these little kind of wood block heels. Um, um, this was on clearance for $3.99. When I picked it up, my 16 year old son was like walking around looking at stuff with me. And, um, well, he was looking at guy stuff, but we were both in the clearance section. And I picked it up and I'm like, ooh, this dress. And he's like, that looks like something that would look good on you. And um, I'm like, it's $3.99. He's like, how is a dress only $3.99? I'm like, I don't know, but I'm about to try it on. And I love it. And I don't have blues like this. So I picked up some colors that are not things that are typically in my wardrobe. And I'm super happy about that. I'm trying to do that more and kind of branch out. I used to wear black and gray. Like that was like all I used to wear. It's been a few years ago now since I was like that, but then once I started like losing weight, I felt more comfortable because I was, I felt like I was always trying to hide in like dark colors and now I like love color. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so I've been branching out, but so I was very happy with this dress, just super simple on the back and, but I just think it's so cute and for $3.99, yes, please, I will take it. So that was my little, um haul from Old Navy while we went on our spring break day trip and I am super happy with what I got. So it was right about $27 for two pairs of pants, a sweater, a sweatshirt, and this dress. So I think that is pretty dang good. Yeah, it's not as good as my thrift hauls, but it's still pretty dang good for all brand new things. Yeah. So um, if you guys enjoyed this type of try on video, please let me know. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you have any suggestions about things that you'd like to see me do differently with it, since it is my first one, um, let me know that as well. I'm trying to find the right place. I like in my living room here because I have a huge picture window, so a lot of light comes in. So that's kind of why I decided to do it here. Um, but I think it's hard to get, I might have to try to get my camera back further so you can see more head to toe. Um, so let me know what you guys think. If you enjoy these type of videos, if you would like to see more because I love clothes and I love putting outfits together. This wasn't a very good putting outfits together video, but um, I can show you different things like that too because I love putting together outfits with accessories and everything. Like that is my first love. Before makeup was clothes and jewelry and shoes and so I'm all about that. So if you guys are interested in that, please make sure to let me know down below and I hope you liked my Old Navy haul and the rest of the awesome things that I got on our spring break day trip. Thanks for watching. Bye.